Welcome. By the end of this video, you will be able to remove background noise from any audio file using the free music software Audacity. Let's get started. So you're going to want to have Audacity open. And if you're not familiar with this program, you're going to want to go ahead and download it and install it on your computer so that you can use it. It is free to use. And when you have it installed, go up to File and then Import Audio. And then that will be able to bring in the audio file that you would like to edit. And then press Open. And then once you have your audio file, it will look something like this in a wave form. And let's go ahead and listen to this audio file so you can see uh, if it has any background noise that we need to remove. Hopefully this helps you remove background noise from your recordings. Okay, so you may have noticed there's not a lot of background noise in this recording. And that's because um, I use a microphone that is very good at determining what is my voice and what is background noise. Um, the microphone I use is the Blue Yeti. And it's a pretty popular and affordable option. And so that's something you can think of first. But let's say you do have a recording that has background noise. Uh, now, this is going to work mainly for something that uh, background noise that occurred during the entire recording or for a large part of the recording. This will not work for one time noises like maybe a dog barking or maybe like a chair moving or something like that. So uh, let, let's go ahead and isolate the background noise in this recording. So you can see right here would be a good selection. So to select, you just go up to the selector tool here and then just uh, click and drag, and then you're going to want to select the background noise. Once you have it selected, go up to Effect, and then you're going to want to go to Noise Reduction. And once you click that, you'll see we have settings. Now, my settings are different than what you probably see because I've done this before. So it'll probably show up like something like this um, with a 12 decibel noise reduction. And so the first thing you're going to want to do is let's just use the settings they have there first, and then just click on Get Noise Profile. Now, when you do this, what it did is it isolated that portion of your recording and it figured out what the profile of that noise was. So now when I go ahead and select the entire recording, I'm going to go and click this gray area here, or you can go up to select all. I have the entire recording selected. Now I go up to effect. And then the first option there should be repeat noise reduction. Now what that will do will be apply the noise reduction to the entire recording. And so now you can see there was a little change in the audio. Let's go ahead and listen to it now and see how it changed the, the sound. Hopefully this helps you remove background noise from your recordings. So if you have headphones on, you probably noticed that it did remove the tiny hissing sound that you heard at the beginning and at the end of this recording. And so that is the easiest way to remove background noise from your recordings. Again, this works well for something like maybe uh, your computer uh, was making a, a slight noise or maybe a, a, any hissing sound in the background. Um, if you have like radiators or something like that, um, it will, you, it'll work well for those kinds of things. Now you can still use this even if uh, you had some other kind of noise and just try to uh, play with the settings to see how you can change the uh, recording. So if that did not work well for you, you can go ahead and play with the settings. So you can select the uh, sound again go up to effect and then click on the noise reduction. And then now in step two, you can go ahead and change this. The, now the noise reduction, the decibels, it, the it, more you increase this, the more your voice or the recording will sound maybe like far away or maybe underwater. Um, but again, you can go ahead and max this out and see if that does the job for you. Uh, you can also change the sensitivity and then the uh, frequency smoothing. So you can just go ahead and play with those and just keep testing it with your audio. Now, what I would do is um, go ahead and just do this one time, you know, each time. You can preview it before you do it as well. So um, once you feel like you've got the right sound, you just press OK. And then you will want to export this audio once it's done. So you go up to File and then Export. And you can export it as different audio files as MP3 or WAV file. One last tip is that if you have a noise that happened one time during the recording, you just want to remove that. What you can do is, uh, let's say this uh, mouse click here at the end, you can see this little mouse click uh, sound. I'm going to highlight that. And then what I'm going to do is instead of doing noise reduction, I'm just going to go up to this uh, button here called silence audio selection. I'm just going to click that. And then now that would have silenced that area. And this only works really after you've done the noise reduction because um, otherwise it's gonna you're gonna hear uh, the change from um, the silence to um, the rest of your recording. So you can isolate one-time sounds like that and then silence them, and then that might help with your recording as well. So you now know how to remove background noise from the recordings in Audacity. If you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comments section below. I do my best to answer those. I have other Audacity tutorials available. I'll put links to them around this video. If you enjoyed this, please like and subscribe. I thank you, and I'll see you in the next video.